City Rep. Emma Costa hosted a meeting this evening to help residents get a better picture of what February 17th will entail, especially if they have plans to be, you know, be a part of the event in some way. ABC 7's Ashley Rodriguez joins us now live. Ashley. Estella, Rick, you have people who really, really want to see mm. the Pope hold his mass in Juarez, but then you start going through the details and all that excitement melts into stress and anxiety. Mm -hmm. It's a lot to plan for. How early would you think you'd need to get there? Questions from concerned Catholics at Repicosta's community meeting. Are they going to be allowed to take chairs? The chance to see Pope Francis for the first time in the El Paso Juarez region, so important, so special, it brought Griselda Quintero to tears. Wow, it's a loss for words. For those who may not fully grasp the significance, think of it as El Paso's chance to shine under an international spotlight. The mayors from both cities are promoting this region to bring more people to, to this area, to, to make business so we can get better wages for everybody. And all that. So I think that the visit from the Pope will give us a a perspective around the world and people will see us in a different manner. No pressure, right? But there's a lot of little devils in the details, especially for Griselda, who wants to travel to Wadis with a toddler. First, she'd have to get a ticket to the Mass from her church. There's no guarantee she will. If she gets a ticket, they will be a certain color. The color will tell her where she can catch a designated bus to get to the stadium. Second, she has to get to Wadis. Wadis officials suggest leaving a day before the visit, whether by car or by foot, expect long, long lines at the designated Santa Fe Bridge. Once Griselda parks, she'd have to walk another five miles to get to the papal route. They have to understand it's going to be a lot of people, so we have to go with that mentality. There's going to be a lot of people. It's not a, that you're going to a picnic, you know what I'm saying. As soon as my kids get out of school on, on Tuesday, go to Juarez. I have uh, relatives over there, but now with what they're saying, that they're going to close the streets, there's no way I could get to my, my relatives. And the Juarez hotels are full. Griselda really, really wants to see the Pope, but as the two cities finalize their plans, she's starting to lose hope. I don't know. I'm just putting it on God's hands. Oh, I just feel for her and everybody who wants to see it. There's a lot of details that you need to iron out now, right. as soon as possible. There's still time. 26 yeah. days to go. Yep. Exactly. Start planning. Ashley.